On this episode of Break Stuff, Learn Something, I'm going to show you how Scrivener works in full screen mode. When you really need to block out distractions and only focus on the draft, full screen mode is the way to go. To access full screen mode, go up to the black box with the arrows and click. This brings up your draft in full screen mode. When you are in full screen mode, the control panel can be accessed by moving your mouse towards the bottom of the screen. The control panel in full screen mode is a stripped down version of what you have outside. You can change the text scale to something that is legible for you. You can adjust the paper position to left, right, or center. You can also use the slider to adjust the width of the paper. The three boxes in the center are set for your keywords, your inspector, and navigation to a different part of your draft. Next to that, you have your word count and character count. And on the far right, you have your background fade. This slider allows you to control the opacity of the slide bars. To exit full screen mode, you can hit escape or the arrows. Like almost anything in Scrivener, the full screen mode is infinitely customizable. To customize the appearance of full screen mode, go to Tools, Options, and then to Appearance. Under Colors, twirl down on full screen mode, and then select Background. I'm going to choose a photo to replace the black. Clicking Apply and then OK will save your customization. To see what has changed, open full screen mode again and you will see here that the black background has been replaced with flowers. Back in the appearance screen, you can see just how much customization is available to you. All of these things are things that you can change in full screen mode and in other modes. At times this level of customization can seem overwhelming, but it's there to make sure that your environment is as comfortable as possible for you to write in.